gonna miss him terribly. Uh, uh, two things I wanna highlight. Um, Miles' first interaction with uh, the rival down the street, um, he was sick and he missed practice. And there was kind of uncertainty, is he gonna play in the game or not? Um, I certainly wasn't going to reprimand him for his absence, knowing that this was his first time playing the rival that he left. And I asked him, are you good to go? And he goes, I, I, I think so, I think I can do it. Um, huge expectations, people are talking, what's he gonna do? Is he gonna you know, perform well, is he not? Is he gonna be nervous, is he gonna choke? What's gonna happen? My goodness, holy moly. Um, the hoop was how big for you that night, Miles? Everything was dropping. He had 26, 20, 26. Um, the game was, was never in doubt. Miles was just in the zone. Um, I was so happy that he had that moment. I was so happy that here, all eyes are on him. He's transferred, he's playing his rival. What's he gonna do? And he totally steps up to the plate and delivers. And he hits a grand slam. And three after three, bucket after bucket, double team, triple team, he's still producing. And it was his moment. And it's one that I'll never forget. Hopefully you'll, you'll take it with you for a long time. Um, we've spent significant time together. You know, we've been on the road. We've been to camps at St. Mary's, Santa Barbara, Chico, Oregon. Um, so we get to spend a lot of time together. And there were a couple times where I thought he should have been acknowledged for a certain accolade or a certain achievement. And sometimes those things are out of my hands. They're in the hands of voters, or if we're at a tournament such as the Wine Valley, it's in the hands of the, the host coach. And as a coach, similar to a parent, you, you wanna fight for your, your kid, you wanna fight for your player. And um, things didn't go as I wanted, uh, Miles Jr. year for all league. Um, I, I felt he got snubbed, and I felt he got snubbed for um, all tournament at the Wine Valley this past year. And I go up to him and I start ranting and just really venting to him and he just says, it's all right coach, you know, we won the game or we got the Constellation Championship or it's no big deal. I'm just glad we were successful as a team. Um, I had to take a lesson from him, you know, to kind of calm down and, and see that character again because for him it wasn't about the individual accolade. Um, and that's rare. Uh, there's plenty of teenagers that would have compounded that and jumped on that bandwagon and said, yeah, coach, those, those jerks, darn those guys. But Miles just said, ah, that's the way it goes sometimes, coach. And oh well, maybe next time. And so I appreciate that. Um, I'm so grateful to be your coach the last couple of years. I'm gonna miss you. Um, I'm gonna be excited to, to follow, uh, follow you and keep going. Luckily, you're, you're in the neighborhood, so maybe check out a game or two. But uh, thank you, Miles, congrats.